Make Volume 19 is where you'll find the Homebrew Alarm Purse by Noreen Letty. For this project, you'll need a 120 decibel siren, a small switch, 9 volt battery and clip, some Velcro, wire, heat shrink tubing, and some cloth material, and of course, your purse. The idea behind this safety purse is the siren will go down inside the purse at the very bottom, and it can be activated with a simple press of a button in case of an emergency. So the first step is to wire up our siren assembly, and we'll use some heat shrink tubing on all the connections, and we'll wire up the siren to our 9 volt battery clip, and then that'll be run to our little switch. I'll also be using a larger piece of heat shrink tubing over the switch, so that'll completely cover up all the contacts. And now it's time to add our 9 volt battery and test out our siren, and yes, that is a shrill, high-pitched siren, perfect for this project. We'll heat up our heat shrink tubing, and now our siren assembly is done. And now it's time to make the fabric pocket that our siren will fit inside of, and there's a template for that. So I cut out some cloth and uh, went to work sewing by hand, which I haven't done in a long time. So the siren and the 9-volt battery will fit inside of the pocket. Now it's time to cut out a port in the bottom of our purse, where the little fabric pocket will sit with our siren. I decided to use a piece of screen because uh, it was black and would let plenty of sound through. So I added both sides of Velcro to that and stuck that inside the purse right over the port. And then added some Velcro to the fabric pocket and put that in the purse. The last step is to mount our switch. So again, two small pieces of Velcro will be used to attach the switch to the very end of the zipper where there's a small opening. And our homebrew alarm purse is done. And that's how to wire up a safety system with Geek Chic, the homebrew alarm purse. We'll see you next time with another weekend project.